Malachi can actually crawl, then she can walk. This seemed like, you know, uh, a shocking thing to some persons because people actually felt, oh my God, that she has a dad's condition. But yeah, 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 she's actually crawling. And I decided to bring the good news to you. Guys, you guys know I've talked about this couple in my channel and I discussed the condition of, you know, listening to you guys, how he has Otisio genesis imperfecta and that is a condition that affects the bones it's a condition that produces genes that normally affect the production of collagen which strengthens the bones so he had this condition but his wife loved him for it and she married him now when they had a child initially like about two years ago people were worried like this particular child oh my god why didn't do ivf where there'll be gene uh, selection you know to remove any gene that you know carries that particular um chromosome or whatever you get the point so that was how you know the news spread people talked about it reactors especially reactors in you know the us the reactors in the uk they, they reacted on this couple okay and i remember talking about them too and i said from the medical perspective i told them that this particular um genetic condition that we've seen have it is not treatable okay the condition does not have a cure but seeing the daughter from that angle when she was young as at six months that's when that particular matter happened when people started talking why is she not crawling at six months every child tends to crawl at six months and i told them to give her some time and then i also said that looking at the baby that she does not have the father's condition that deep it looks like there are traces of it but her own might not be that severe because this particular condition have severe cases and you know uh, cases that are mild so it looks like she's having you know the mild cases and i talked about this thing very very intensively and i brought in you know health factor into the whole thing and i explained a lot of things i think about a year ago now so shocking they posted a video yesterday when i was watching that video i was so happy to see malaika actually move from one point to the other even though some persons are saying that she's only just uh, moving from one place to the other no now she moved her leg malaika actually crawled she crawled crawling is different from she's swimming from one place to the other the way people always talk about and all that okay now she actually moved she crawled she moved her legs she moved forward she used her hand as in like so if she can crawl she can she can also walk i know that some of you will be like what's so important about a baby crawling you don't get it this baby is a baby that people have always you know talked about it their lovers have always wished for malika to crawl whereas the ones that don't love them are always blaming them for it you get saying that if you know this is this why need to go for ivf or other methods of giving birth and for me it is wrong they decide to test their faith okay and they have a lovely baby they don't regret it the mom don't regret it the dad don't regret it and they are so happy with their their family now back to uh something they discussed in that particular video and i want to talk about i'm so glad that she's trying to you know get help because for a long while people have been complaining under the comment section why she has refused to have a help because it seemed like you know uh wilson himself has been living alone according to him his parents you know we are late he has been living alone even before he met his wife okay now meeting her he has been you know practically she's the one you know doing almost everything in the house cooking washing everything in the house but i noticed that wilson can actually make coffee and bring to her okay he can make coffee he can he can do one or two things moving around okay so it's not as if he can't really help but the major thing she's the one doing it and then for the fact that you know malika too she have to be carrying her from year to year and you know malika is like over two years right now i think and she she have to be like she's exhausted sometimes she talk about how exhaustion is killing her how tired she is and and people are beginning to like feel pity for her and telling her you can afford this yeah they are doing well they are big youtubers they are making cool money so she can actually get a nanny our last video before this video people actually complained and talked intensively over her getting the help and people were wondering why wilson is not helping out but you expect wilson to cook it might be it might be that yes he used to cook those days you get the point maybe he used to cook those days when he was not married but now that they are married come on and again remember these people are african so remember i think she's from zimbabwe i think the guy is kenya i think so 
I think so. Now, the truth of the matter is, they are Africans. And you know that our African culture, the woman tends to do almost everything, okay? Except in situations whereby you can afford help or the country you are, is easy to get help. All these house helps, okay? To help around. But now, she's the one doing everything and she complains of being exhausted. Sometimes she complains of how she cannot do her money routines, how her skin is becoming dry and flaky. Sometimes she just complains how she could not, you know, moisturize her face because she had been busy. One or two, it just hints, okay? Just normal hints that a vlogger would give. But people are beginning to say no. For you not to be having time for yourself, even to do exercise or whatever, that is because she's taking care of two uh, persons all by herself and also taking care of herself. But now she has decided to get help, okay? In this uh, video today, she, uh, she said that they will be getting a nanny for Malaika. And I'm so happy because Malaika also needs to, like, you know, go out, meet more persons or be introduced to another person so that she can speak faster, so that she can, you know, interact. And also, you don't know the, the miracle that person can even bring to Malaika. Maybe Malaika might be comfortable with her parents, okay? But when she gets another person, she might be comfortable to the uh, uh, point of, you know, standing up and moving. And before you know, Malaika will start moving. And it's, it's, it's just going to be like a miracle to your eyes, okay? And I'm so glad because I remember talking about this and I said that it could be, it could be that her condition will not be like at that soon. And she's crawling. If a baby can crawl, if her limbs are strong enough to crawl at this age, man, she can walk. She can walk. And I know that Malaika will work on this channel and I will come here and talk about it. Yes, I will. And I pray that this, you know, this couple continue to stay strong because it is not easy. Even when they got married, people came for them. I remember, see, I know, I know people be like, how can a beautiful woman be going for such a man? How can a beautiful woman, but what, what's wrong with him, okay? What's wrong with him? He's only physically challenged. It's only physically challenged. And she, she said that they started as being friends. And they say, when you are friends with somebody and you love the person's humor, not just, just the person's appearance, you started loving the person's humor. And you know that this person will not give you a problem in marriage. Don't just look at beauty and get married. Some people look at beauty, get married. They look at a, a man being handsome, they get married without looking at the man's character. And today they are divorced, okay? So at least this couple, they've been married for at least more than two years. And they are still waxing strong. They are still waxing strong. She did not care anything. She did not care. I know that sometimes some people will be like, why didn't she care? If at all she's married to him, they are supposed to you know, do some form of, you know, um, selection, IVF, or whatever, to have, you know, babies that they are not going to suffer. I understand that point, and I don't want to dive into it that much. But I'm just here to tell you people that Malaika can now work. And again, concerning uh, the mother being exhausted and tired as always, you know, she's getting a help. She will soon get the help, okay? According to her, a nanny is coming so soon. She tied to that video that um, she said this is um, long overdue, meaning that she knows, she deep down knows that it's long overdue for them to get the help. Anyway, guys, please do subscribe to the channel. Bye for now.